Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x power 3 minus 2 plus square root of 2 bracket times x plus 2 is equal to 0. To find the values of x from this equation. Now, in the first step, from here in the left side, we'll take this negative x inside this bracket. So, it will be this, which is x power 3, then negative x times 2 is negative 2x. Negative x times square root of 2 is negative square root of 2x. Then plus this, 2 is equal to 0. Then in the next step, from this square root of 2, and this 2 and this 2 is related. So we will let y is equal to this square root of 2, then when we square in both sides, it will be y square is equal to the square of square root of 2, it is 2, whereas this is 2. So the, for this 2, we we'll substitute y square. Then our equation will be this, which is x power of 3, then minus 2, it will be minus 2 here, it is this y square. So it will be y square, then times x. Then minus this square root of 2, it is y. So it will be y times x is y x. Then plus this 2, 2 is this y square. So it will be plus y square is equal to 0. Then in the next step, from here x power 3 minus y square x, x is common. So we'll take x out of bracket x power 3 divided by x is x square. Negative y square x divided by x is negative y square. Then bracket. Then into here, we'll take negative y out of bracket. So we'll take this negative y out of bracket. Negative y, square, negative y times x divided by negative y is positive x. Positive y square divided by negative y is negative y, then bracket is equal to 0. Then in the next step, it will be this, which is x. Into here, x square minus y square, this is in the form of a perfect square. So this is same as bracket x plus y bracket times bracket x minus y bracket, then minus y. This bracket x minus y bracket is equal to 0. Then in the next step, into here, x minus y is common. So we'll take x minus y bracket out of bracket. Then this, this divided by x minus y, it is x times this x plus y. So it will be this time this. So here inside the bracket is x bracket x plus y bracket then this minus y times x minus y divided by x minus y is this minus y so here minus y bracket is equal to zero then in the next step it will be x minus y bracket bracket here we we'll open this inner bracket by this x so x times x is x squared then x times y, it will be plus xy. Then this minus y bracket is equal to 0. Then from here, we have two solutions. Or first, we'll, start by, we'll substitute the values of y, this y, y, y. Whereas y, it is this square root of 2. So into this equation, it will be x minus y which is before we let as square root of 2 then bracket this x square then plus x times y y is square root of 2 so square root of 2 times x is square root of 2 x then minus y which is square root of 2 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions whereas this is the first solution x minus square root of 2 is equal to this 0 and this is the second solution which is x square plus 
square root of 2 x minus square root of 2 is equal to 0. Then in the next step, from this first solution, we will take negative square root of 2 to the right side. So it will be x is equal to square root of 2. So this is the first value of x. Now to find the value of x from this quadratic equation, we will use quadratic formula. So from quadratic formula, which is x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then it will be x is equal to negative. Our b here, it is this square root of 2. So square root of 2, then plus or minus square root of b square. It will be this square root of 2 square. So into here is square root of 2 bracket square. Then minus 4 times a, a is 1. Then times c, c is this negative square root of 2. So here bracket negative square root of 2 bracket. Then over 2 times a, a is 1. Then it will be x is equal to negative square root of 2 plus or minus square root of into here this square root will cancel this square so it will be 2 then minus times this minus it will be positive so it will be positive 4 times square root of 2 so here 4 square root of 2 then over 2 times 1 is 2 then from here we have two solutions because of plus or minus therefore because in here we have two solutions plus this is the third solution therefore our conclusion the first value of x is equal to this square root of 2 and the second value of x is equal to negative square root of 2 so here negative square root of 2 then plus plus square root of 2 plus 4 square root of 2 so here 2 plus 4 square root of 2 then over this 2 and the third value of x is equal to into here it has negative so it will be minus square root of 2 then minus square root of 2 plus 4 square root of 2 so here 2 plus 4 square root of 2 then over this 2 therefore these are all the three values of x into this our problem thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.